Hello YouTube, this is an alcohol review of Captain Morgan Black Spiced Rum. It says on the bottle, crafted using only the finest Caribbean rum and select spices, Captain Morgan Black Spiced Rum is finished with double oak blackening, with double charred blackened oak for a taste as bold as the legendary buccaneer. Caribbean rum with select spices and natural flavors, double charred blackened oak, 47.3 alcohol per volume, 94.6 proof, 750 milliliter bottle. This has come to my attention, A, I like spiced rums, this little cork thing, but the fact that in many different reviews, some say it's better than Kraken. Now, I have to say, I am not a huge fan of Kraken rum. So, it perked my ears when they mentioned that this is better than Kraken. It is a nice, deep, dark caramel. I would say dark brown, but it's not. It's more of a dark caramel with a red in hue to it. It has a syrupy smell to it. I smell um, maple. Sugar. A bit of fruity highlights. Caramel. But no real alcohol to it. It's a very, very nice scent. Almost light. Now, I've had... Uh, it's called... Um, oh, jeez. Helicopter's coming in. There it goes. <laughs> Not a black hawk. Not black. It's okay. But a very light scent to it. Tears up nicely on the side of the glass. Strong. Bitey. Oh my. I expected all these nice flavors to come out that match with the scent, but it's not that at all. It's rough as harsh. It, it's odd. It comes in with uh, a bite to it and doesn't stop biting. That sharp, almost pin like stabs in the tongue. Um, and then you get hit with um, kind of this wash of muted flavors. And it ends with this very strong alcohol heat. Wants to come up into the sinuses. Okay, now it's starting to kill off those tongue cells and the taste buds. Now I can actually start tasting things. It's. I think. Uh, molasses that's been overcooked. No real fruitiness to it, and slightly chemically because of the alcohol burn. But yeah, a heavy. A, a molasses would actually give you flavors of sugar and sweetness in it. But this doesn't. It's just a heaviness, and it um, doesn't. It's a it's a charred flavor, but not like a charred like. Like you'd find on a meat, not a, not a charred savory, not like burnt, like it's uh, charcoal, but it's definitely a 
a charred flavor. That's being hit with um, an overcooked molasses. I mean, it wants to give you flavors, but it doesn't. There's, there's very little there. It's just heavy all the way through. The mouthfeel is light. It's um, very watery, so it's the, the, the smell is very light and delicate, but the taste is so harsh. But you'd expect a, a heavy mouthfeel, and there is no heavy mouthfeel to it. I would mix this with a Sprite, maybe a Coke, you know, a, 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 a soda of some sort. But, oh my, I would not drink it straight if uh, given the option. This, they say, like I said, the, the others on YouTube make the statement that it's better than Kraken. And I said, I'm not a fan of Kraken, but it's been a while since I've had it. So it's hard to tell exactly why they like it better than, uh, than Kraken, but I'm not a fan of this at all. Uh, whether you'd have this in the winter or summer or whenever, I, I would cut this sharply with um, anything to help to still drive the taste out, just go for the alcohol part of it. Now, there's a variety of cocktails that require a dark rum, plus a light rum, plus whatever, anything else. Um, along on a nice tea, something along that line. That may be a good mix with this, but that's all. There you go. This is a review of Captain Morgan Black Spice Rum Double Charred Black and Oak. Give this product a try yourself. After all, this is my simple opinion, but definitely buy a bottle, try it yourself, see what you think. Write any comments about this product down below. I'm sure there's there's a buttload of people who think this is this is the cat's meow. I would love to hear from you guys to see at least to hear what I'm missing out of this. Better yet, for those of you else out there, buy the product, try it, post yourself on YouTube, giving your review of this particular. Uh, rum. And until next time, keep on drinking.